my name is Laura Bushy from Kitchen of Life and feel free to check out our website at kitchenoflife.com. Click on meet our team tab and you can meet our other awesome health educators. Today I'm going to talk to you about better looking skin through hydration and regardless of what age you are, everyone at any age is concerned about their skin. Um, I'm definitely concerned about my skin. I'm 43 years old and I'd like to have my skin look as great as it possibly could be. And I'm going to, today I'm going to give you some tips on how to do that through hydration. So this might seem like common sense or very simple to you, but the most important form of hydration comes in water. Our body is made of, of mostly water, and so it's very important to drink water. The question would be, how much water do you drink during the day? You basically drink half of your body weight in ounces. I'm 120 pounds, so I'm going to be drinking about 60 ounces of water a day. Here's a 12 ounce glass. I'd have about five of these during the day, and this is my travel or to-go cup. Um, I prefer to drink in glass, and this is 20 ounces. I need to have um, at least three of these a day. For those of you who don't love the taste of water, um, I have filtered water, and this particular glass, these are very easy to get at a discount store. I get this at Target. I add fruit, so I have a citrus drink, lemons, limes, and oranges, and I leave it in here. You can use any form or any variation, strawberry and mint. Um, and this is basically very flavorful. So this basically is where you want to begin. At the very least, make sure you're drinking half your body weight in ounces of water. So remember, today we're talking about hydrating the skin. So it's basically whatever we're taking in internally. And I talked to you about water, but if you really wanna kick it up a notch and have beautifully vibrant skin, there are other things you can add into your daily regimen. So I do this in addition to my 60 ounces of water. And here I have coconut water. Coconut water is loaded with electrolytes, which is fabulous for the body. And it has tons of potassium, which is great for hydration. Now I know you can get potassium from bananas, but we're not talking about anything that we're eating. We're talking about what we're drinking. And uh, coconut water just happens to be a very expensive version of potassium. Bananas are a lot cheaper, but we're talking about strictly hydration. Um, all you need to do, because it is expensive and all you really need during the course of the day is eight ounces. Um, here I have a mason jar, I have ball, the brand ball, these are very trendy. They come in multiple colors. Um, there's actually measurements right on the side. So all we need to do is fill this much with coconut water. For those of you who don't like the taste of coconut water, there are other varieties on the market that include pineapple and other um, varieties. But just keep in mind, when you start adding in other fruit, you're adding in sugars. And sugar is going to work against you when it comes to hydrating the skin. So to take it to the ultimate level of hydration, you might want to include green juices or juices into your diet. Um, the particular brand that I have today is Suja Juice. You can make juices at home with a juicer, but that's for a different video. We're not going to get into juicing right now. I'm thinking of quick things that you can add into your diet. Uh, Suja Juices you can find generally at most grocery stores. Sometimes they're on sale, which makes it a little bit more affordable. Um, do whatever is in your budget. But I particularly love these. These are essential. This is a green juice. And keep in mind, anytime you talk about a hydration, again, you wanna keep the sugar intake to an almost minimal amount, and you just wanna focus on hydration. Um, juicing is a fabulous way. Always make sure that when you're drinking a juice, you're doing it on, a, on an empty stomach. You don't necessarily have to do that when it comes to drinking water or the coconut water, but for these, uh, it's highly recommended. Um, in this particular, um, bottle, there are six grams of sugar, which would be ideal, and that's really coming from the grapefruit that is included in here. Although you might not love the taste of these, if you're taking um, into consideration you want beautifully uh, illuminated, hydrated skin, this is the best way to go. And these are green juices, these are the best. There are other juices that are on the market that are more colorful, they have more fruit included in them. Um, I would just suggest drinking these in minimal amounts. Um, but they're also, they have great ingredients in here that are great for your internal organs and for your skin as well. But keep in mind, I recommend these. 
So remember, today I shared with you the very basics of um, internal hydration. In subsequent videos, we'll talk about other things that you can do to have healthier, uh, illuminated skin, better looking skin. But today we focused on the basics. It was remember your half your weight, body weight of, in ounces of water, uh, coconut water, eight ounces, and about eight to 12 ounces of a green juice. And remember, just do whatever your budget allows. Now, keep in mind, I gave you great tips on how to remain hydrated and have healthier looking skin. There are ways that you can um, basically work against what I just told you. And that is consuming soda, having anything with caffeine, like coffee, even black tea, and drinking alcohol, especially alcohol. So try and give your body a break. Try and see what your skin will do for you. Give yourself about seven days without those caffeinated items and the alcohol and add in those tips that I shared with you. And um, so basically, thanks for listening and watching in. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Kitchen of Life. Go to our website, kitchenoflife.com. Sign up for our newsletter and uh, have a great day.